Hello, everyone, and good afternoon to you. Welcome to another video tutorial on the XAU USD. And in fact, this is going to be a follow up video to my previous analysis on the spare. And talking about previous analysis, um, last week was a roller coaster of buys and sells. And we were lucky enough to take advantage of most of these opportunities um during the course of last week so at the beginning of the week we saw this bullish momentum which we initially missed as this happened during the early hours of the week and we were able to identify a channel between the 1865 and the 1880 where we were looking out for either a breakout or breakdown to give us an opportunity to buy or sell then when we scale down a little bit into the 15 minutes time frame on that on that day we saw the simple structure here after noticing selling pressure below the 1880 then we look we use the 1876 level as a, as a leverage to join a bearish momentum which we did moved our stop loss accordingly and price action continued to give us some selling momentum right below the 1880 a couple of times and then we wrote the move all the way into the 1870 where we started seeing buy pressure come in on the 10th of january we started seeing buy pressure around that area which gave us a sign that there is a tendency that buyers might likely come in at this point and we were looking out for a breakout of the 1876 to give us that leverage to join that buy position despite holding on to sell position so at that point in time on on the eleventh, we saw the breakout finally and finally breakout of the 1880 giving us further confirmations to add more position to our existing trade and we were able to ride that move a little bit locked in some profit taken out of the position again and we also um, had some selling opportunities before another wave of bullish momentum came in as soon as price got back into that demand zone we identified earlier and we were lucky enough to catch that move above the $1,876 level we rode the move all the way up and we added more positions and price action moved in our favor prior to the CP high after which we left the market and waited for another opportunity after identifying a channel between the $1,895 and the $1,900 when we said we are going to be buying if price breaks out of the $1,900 level and it actually did here and we were able to take some profit on that if you'd like to see how this went by with the daily commentaries therein i will be linking that link sending the link to that video right in the comment section of this video and if you are watching on my trading view platform you will be seeing it in the um description box below and at the same time i will be sharing it at the top right hand side of my screen so with that being said let's dive into the current structure here and what we are going to be looking at is the daily time frame and looking at what has been happening here since the beginning of the year you can see that the 1800 dollars level which has been a major determinant of price action throughout the course of last year was finally broken and price action continued to find higher highs after the breakout of the 1820 dollar level so it has been a bullish momentum here for the XAUSD since the beginning of the year as price action continued to find higher highs. So right now I have a new setup, a new structure which we shall be using to guide our trading activity for this week. And one of the structures is the 1860 which was broken at the beginning of last week's trading session. And then we saw price culminate at the 1920 where price closed for last week's trading session and going into the new week here we are going to be waiting and see how price action will react to the structure to decide if we are going to be buying or selling the XAU USD. so if at any point in time during um, the week we start seeing sudden pressure below the structure we might likely want to be joining a decline into the 1860 probably in anticipation of another wave of bullish momentum or if price breaks down the structure then we might see a situation where price comes back to do a retest of the 1820 dollar level 
which also shares a confluence with that bullish trend line that has been guiding bullish momentum since the later part of last year to incite another wave of bullish momentum so this is what we are this is one of the situations we are going to be looking forward to and if instead price climbs up the 1920 followed by buying pressure right above the structure then we will definitely have no choice but to get ready to join a rally to the upside now with this being said here on the daily time frame i would like us to see what is going on on the four hours time frame where we will be look seeing what i was able to identify here and what and this structure we i identified here shall be the basis from which we shall be trading the XUUSD for this week but before i go into the lower time frame here let's quickly run through the economic calendar uh, where i was able to identify a couple of events that we'll definitely be looking forward to to uh, bring some catalyst and probably bring liquidity into the market to drive price action so we will be focusing on macroeconomic events that will be affecting the dollar and talking about that we are we have is um an event coming up on wednesday i think we even have two of them coming up on wednesday we have the retail sales month of month and then we have the retail sales group control group also for the month of december coming up on that same day and from the look of things here uh, it appears we have um um some level of indecisiveness here as the consensus for the retail sales control is still minus 0 0.2 percent which is also the same thing at what happened the previous month then for the other one here we have a little bit hope for the dollar as consensus are projecting a 0 0.1 percent against the minus 0 0.6 percent which is something positive that we might be looking forward to and these are major events that participants in the market will be looking forward to and this the anticipation of this event will be reflected on the chart as price action so going back into the chart and scaling down to the four hours time frame let's quickly have a technical perspective into what our expectations are and what we want to be looking out for to um, buy or sell the XAUSD. now looking at the structure we have here and considering what has been happening here since the beginning of last week the first thing i did here was to identify the fact that price has been bullish and as a result of that i connected the series of higher lows and that gave us this resultant bullish trend line that you can see on your screen right now and since price broke out of the 1885 it appears that um the current structure is mature for a possible retracement so a retracement at this point is long overdue and i'm of the opinion that we might have a situation if selling pressure continues below the 1920 we might see a situation where price comes back into the 1895 a level which shares a confluence with that bullish trend line we identified earlier and if buy pressure comes in at that structure then we will definitely be getting ready to join another wave of bullish momentum however if price breaks down the structure with selling pressure below this level then that's a beautiful sign that the bullish trend line there is no longer strong enough to hold by pressure then we might likely see a situation where a sell-off will happen back into that major bullish trend line that has been guiding bullish momentum since the later part of last year so that is one scenario i will be looking forward to based on the current structure we have here on the daily time on the four hours time frame then the other situation that we shall be looking forward to is if price instead of dropping to the downside it climbs to the upside breaking out of the 1920 a level which has been holding selling pressure for about eight hours before the close of last week's trading session then i will be seeing that as a sign that buyers have taken out all the sell positions here bringing some liquidity into the market for buyers to take advantage of another wave of bullish momentum and definitely we will be getting ourselves prepared to join that rally if that happens so i would like to pause the video at this point and i hope this video has been of immense help in making your personal decision on the XAUUSD for this week and if it did kindly support this project by clicking the like button you would also want to follow me on my trading view platform at Dark Sherry, spelled D-A-R-C, 
S H E R R Y, so that you don't miss out on all of the daily commentaries I normally share on all of my videos. Thank you for watching this video, and I look forward to seeing you right in the comment section as usual as we get ourselves prepared for the new week. Do have a wonderful evening. See you on Monday. Bye bye.